about buried treasure. Now, I don't know if uh, those kind of books are around anymore, but um, when I was reading a verse from the Bible this week, it reminded me of a story about buried treasure. Um, usually the story is about um, a group of people called pirates who uh, have chests full of gold and jewelry and 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 they find an island somewhere and they bury it so nobody can find it and then they come back and get the treasure and uh, later on cash it in for all the money it's worth. So what I decided to do is to draw a map. Okay, you're not going to be impressed with this map because I'm not an artist. But this is an island, okay, and these are trees. These are, this is a mountain in the middle of the island and some small mountains there. These are palm trees, this is a beach, and these are more trees. Now on this island is buried treasure, and X marks the spot. So what the pirates did is they buried the treasure here and they put a stone to, to make sure they could find it afterwards. Okay, now Jesus used this idea to also talk about his love for us. He said his love is like a person who knew there was buried treasure in a field. And he wanted that treasure so much that he sold everything he had to buy that field and then he would have the buried treasure. So, um, to show us how we find God's love, that's not buried, that's wide open. All you have to do is look at one of these. That's a cross. A cross shows us how much Jesus loves us because he died on that cross in order that we might have forgiveness and eternal life with him. And that's why we have a big cross up in front of our church to remind us every single week of how much God loves us and that nothing will ever be able to take that love away from us. So remember that, boys and girls, and let's give a prayer of thanks for God's love. Dear Lord, we thank you for the gift of your son, Jesus, who loved us so much that he died on the cross to save us from our sin and gain for us eternal life. Help us to have faith and trust in this promise and to follow you always. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 